friends. Welcome to our channel. My name is Debbie and I work with my husband Mark to refinish, repurpose and restore. And it has been a while since we've made a video. And the reason why is because we have been working tire tirelessly at 268 Park Street. We've been traveling between Ann Arbor and Penwater, Michigan every weekend during the summer. We've had some fun too, but we've done a lot of work. But before we get into what 268 Park Street looks like right now, I just want to do a little recap on how do you know if your house is over 100 years old? And I'm gonna give you 10 things to look for that we have at 268 Park Street. So let's get started. One of the first things that you see at 268 Park Street when you pull up is a horse step and tie down. So a visitor coming to 268 Park Street would either pull up next to this and get off their horse and tie him up, or they could get out of their carriage and do the exact same thing. Number two would be ornate woodwork and hardware. As you can see, the doorknob and the escutcheon are beautiful. Number three is a dumbwaiter. This you will see is actually lined in metal to keep things warm. But number four is a laundry chute, and that is what my husband turned the dumbwaiter into, and it extends from the second floor. Number five is a coal chute. Here is the door on the inside of the basement. There is a door on the other side, which has been closed up. Number six, is a coal room. So this is where they would actually shovel the coal out to put into the heater that was in the room next to it. But now we use it for storage. Number seven are servant stairs. These actually go up to the kitchen area and allow the servant to do her job without being seen by the family or the family's guest. Number eight is beautiful built-ins. There are built-ins all over 268 Park Street, upstairs and downstairs. This one is in the library. Number nine are pocket doors, and we have several of these throughout the house, upstairs and downstairs, doubles as well as singles. And number 10 is push button light switches, which are quite unique and located in several of the different rooms of the house. So there are a lot of great things in 268 Park Street that make the house stand out from the house next door or even my house here in Ann Arbor. I hope you enjoyed our little tour of 10 things that will clue you in on your house being over 100 years old. And I hope you will give us a like, maybe even subscribe and hit that bell because that will actually help our channel grow. We promise that we will be a little bit more diligent in regards to our video and keeping you up with things that are going on at 268 Park Street. By the way, we have identified what the name of our guest house is going to be, and that will take you to another video. Thank you for watching. Bye.